The question we must now ask is whether or not to extend the state of emergency, and if yes, for how long? After much discussion and deliberation among our parties, legal, medical, and economic advisors, our parliamentary caucus has approved our support for an extent to the national state of emergency for 30 days, starting May 1st, 2020. And I'll explain why, Madam Speaker. This is our recommendation because our public health authorities, people with specialization in public health, epidemiology, clinical health and hospital management, believe that keeping people at home for 30 more days represents our best means of further containing the spread of the coronavirus at this time. Now this does not mean that if at the end of the, this 30 days that we may need to extend, we advise that we need to extend the state of emergency that we would not support it. We just believe that if 30 days, uh, Madam Speaker, should be enough at, at this time. Now there is no time for complacency and carelessness or, or the kind of irresponsible actions that could render meaningless all the progress we have thus far achieved. And need I say with much sacrifice from everyone. As we support a 30 days renewal of the state of emergency, we call on the government and yes, the National Oversight Committee, which I could chair, to make full and good use of this time to do the following. One, significantly increase testing for COVID-19 in every district across the country, in the cities, the towns, the villages. We should hire hundreds of people, give them short training courses and set them out in our towns and our cities, in our communities, in our villages, to hunt down the virus, Sus identify suspects, test widely, isolate, and if necessary, treat the positive cases. They need to do this in their areas repeatedly until we can overcome this virus. 